All right, we got some new toys from Humminbird here. This is the Humminbird Apex. I haven't got to use it for very long, but the clarity is just amazing. We're gonna go right along, do a little fishing, and show y'all how to use it. The Humminbird Apex comes in 13, 16, and 19 inch units. So no matter what size boat you have, there's gonna be a unit that's gonna fit it nicely. Like on here, for example, we have two 13 inch units flush mounted in the dash and it makes a really clean, uh, sleek flush mounting application. I love to have a clean dash. And with this Apex, of course, I got a NEMA plug on there where I can hook this into my engine controls and the rest of the boat. And I can have all my gauges right here in front of me without having to actually mount them in the dash. The Apex has cross-touch technology, which I love. And what that means is it's a touch screen, but we also have buttons on the side. We can be running like this and get into some rough sea conditions. And I can use these buttons and, and it's easy to control the unit. Whereas any other time, of course, I'm gonna use the touchscreen technology, which is, you know, the easiest. These Apex units are so clear because they're in full HD. All sizes are in full HD. So I have my Coastmaster card dialed in in this Apex unit. And what that does, it gives me really accurate contour lines and I can actually find troughs and pockets that exist right here along the coast that are gonna hold fish. And I've fished these same waters my entire life and I've actually found places that hold fish that I didn't even know existed. Everything is gonna be clear in HD. We're pulling up on a well-known wreck here and having a good chart and good technology to get us right on the wreck I mean, that's great, but this is where Humminbird really shines is when you look at this, I mean, how clear these images are right here of not only just the wreck, but all the bait fish holding on it. We can use our side imaging right here to actually see where all this bait is holding in relation to the wreck, which in turn is gonna show us where the fish are at. What's great about Apex, it combines the data from two different sonar ports together to create one great image. We have a really diverse fishery here and with the new Apex, I have two sonar ports in the back, so I'm not forced to have one transducer that's giving me information. Side imaging, down imaging, you can hook that into port number one. That's a one kilowatt transducer port, but doesn't stop there. We have a second transducer port that can handle up to two kilowatts, so you can still mark the bottom clearly like this in extreme depths. The best thing is, you don't have to work all that out while you're on the water. The machine itself is gonna blend that information together to give you one clear image. I mean, I really can't think of a better example. Of course, we see the bottom, but instead of just seeing something here, we can see the structure, we see all this bait fish all around here, but look right here. These are all the game fish that we're after right there. This is the type of clarity that Humminbird's known for. You can see your jig going down right there and you can see the fish getting hooked and then fighting back up. You know, the sonar on this Apex is amazing. I mean, you have this HD, super clear screen, super easy to read, but honestly, that's just where it's beginning because it's part of the One Boat Network and this is something I use on a daily basis, is the fact that once I, I establish where the fish are at in relation to the wreck, then I can simply, let's say the fish are all the way down here at the other end of this wreck, I could select that waypoint I've dropped at the other end and simply hit go to. And now my Altera is gonna drive us to that waypoint and then hold us right there. And hands-free, the trolling motor is gonna hold me right on the spot and we can just fish. You know something really cool? Today, all the fish we're catching is all these Humminbird technologies coming together. The chart we're using, the Coastmaster, has this spot right here programmed into it. Okay, so all we did was run out here, 
uh, pick one of these wrecks that's on the Coastmaster. We pull up here, we can see where all the bait marks on it. We can see the fish that are there. We put the trolling motor in the water, hit spot lock, and sit here and start catching fish. Some days it's just that easy. If you have the right stuff, it makes it easy a lot of the time. <laughs>